Module 1, How the Brain Works. The thinking part of the brain is called the cerebrum. The cerebrum has two halves, called hemispheres. The cerebrum has four lobes that mirror one another on the two hemispheres of the brain. At the back of the brain is the occipital lobe, which is primarily responsible for managing visual information. The occipital lobe is vulnerable to any direct blow to the back or front of the head. Module 2, Definition of a Concussion. A concussion is an altered state of consciousness that results from a trauma. An altered state of consciousness is represented by any loss of consciousness, any loss of memory for events immediately before or after the accident. Module 3, Metabolic Changes Following a Concussion. The violent movement of the brain inside the skull produces an alteration of consciousness in several ways. The long axons of neurons that connect the lobes of the brain are vulnerable to... Module 4, Symptoms of Concussion. There are various classification systems available for grading the severity of a concussion. We suggest the system used by the Canadian Hockey Association. The CHA divides concussions into two levels of severity, simple and complex. Module 5, Concussion Management. When someone has a head injury, then you must always be suspicious of a neck injury. Do not attempt to move an unconscious youngster unless...